These are the REI Camp Dreamer booties and I don't like them. I don't think you should buy them. So I've had these for about a month now. Uh, I use these for just walking my dog. Generally, I just have these type of shoes somewhere near the door for this time of year. I live in Seattle. It doesn't rain that much. It gets a little misty and stuff during the winter time, but I like something that I could just easily slip on to throw out the trash, uh, go grab something out of my truck, or just take my dog on a walk. And when I say a walk, I'm talking about something that's like a 20 minute walk in kind of like maybe drizzly rain, something pretty mild, nothing. I'm not taking her out in like heavy rainstorms or anything like that. So these are just like something I need to slip on really easily that provides some level of grip, some level of like mild rain protection and just kind of some warmth. So nothing, nothing serious. I don't expect a whole lot from these. Uh, but these are not providing even that minimal level of like protection that I'm expecting. I've tried a lot of different shoes in the past. I've worn Crocs. I have my Birkenstocks and I've had like Native and uh, North Face Thermal Balls. And overall, out of all those, I'd recommend the North Face Thermal Balls. I don't know why I didn't just buy another pair of those when those wore out. I thought maybe there would be something better and that just... Uh, Maybe it goes to show maybe the grass is not always green or you should just stick with something that works. And I should have just stuck with the North Face Thermal Balls because those worked. Uh, but these are the REI Camp Dreamer Booties, I think is the te technical name. Uh, I'll put a link in the description and the correct title and everything and all that. But I have a few problems with these. So like I mentioned, I expect these to be somewhat useful just going for dog walks. Uh, the problem with these is they're really slippery. So sometimes, especially here in Seattle during the winter, there's tends to be kind of moss, water, um, just concrete can be kind of slippery a little bit. And these don't provide any kind of slip protection. And I know I'm not supposed to expect a lot. These are just kind of little camp shoes, but thermal balls are fine. My Crocs are fine. I'm not slipping or falling in those, but these I'm slipping around my driveway. And I don't know what it is with the compound because it feels like it's pretty rubbery and grippy. But when you actually wear them, they're not really that all, like all that useful. So grip is bad with these. Um, I don't feel really comfortable walking around without like slipping in these, and I don't. They don't provide a lot of confidence in general, uh, especially not like my thermal balls. For whatever reason, those work better. Uh, they are warm. Uh, they're about the equivalent or warmer than pretty much anything else I have. So they, in that category, they do succeed. Uh, but they're not easy to get on and these are the whole main purpose of these is that they're easy to get on um, If I was willing to just waste time and put on like spend five minutes of the door tying up shoes I'll just wear boots like normal hiking boots when I go walk my dog But I want something that's easy to get on and off because these are supposed to be quick and easy That's the purpose of these but you could tell by the fact that they provide two separate areas to grip these and kind of pull on your neck To get these on that these are not going to be easy to get on and off and they're not. You have to really kind of wrestle with them. And if you don't have a chair to sit in when you're putting these on, they're not easy. You can't just slip these on and off. They're not just like an easy thing when you're just trying to go out the door really quick. You have to sit down. You have to really yank at these, pull them on. And then they're so tight around your ankle, which maybe you would think is a positive because it kind of keeps our rain and keeps everything tight and warm. But it just makes it too hard to get on and off. And I really feel like these little pull stringy things are going to rip eventually just because you have to pull them so hard to get your foot in and it's not like i bought a size that's too small these fit perfectly once i get them on and there's room in the toe there's room all around it's not like it's overly snug or anything it's just that this little opening is way too tight and that also causes problems because it rubs a lot on my ankle so if i'm not really wearing like really tall long socks uh it rubs a lot on your ankle which is a problem because if I'm just running out and I'm wearing low socks and maybe not like any socks at all, then it's rubbing all on your ankles and it kind of creates hot spots and it's really uncomfortable. Like ugh, something you'd expect from like a hiking boot if you're wearing the wrong socks with those. And like I said, these are not hiking boots. These are supposed to be casual wear. So then you throw on when you just run outside really quick and they're really not comfortable, especially for the price. They've been on sale for quite a bit, um, especially this past season through Black Friday and everything for about $50 on sale. But the normal price is pretty equivalent to the North Face Thermal Balls, which are a much better deal in my opinion. So I'm not going to get rid of these just because I know if I return them, like, who knows where they're going to end up. They might end up in the trash. 
and I just don't like the idea of these being wasted. So I'm gonna wear these through, I'm gonna commit to this because I made the mistake of buying them. Generally, I really like REI stuff because I think they provide a good value and a lower barrier to entry, especially in terms of price, but um, not in this case. I'm not really kind of like coming down on the REI brand in general, just I don't like these camp booties specifically. I'm the type of person that likes REI a lot. I like the brand. I like just walking around the stores when I want to waste some time. Uh, but I don't like these uh, camp booties. So don't buy these. Spend maybe $10 more. Get the North Face uh, Thermo Balls. Those are a lot better deal. They're much more comfortable, warmer, and just all around better quality shoes. So unfortunately, I don't recommend these. But there's good alternatives. So you're not kind of completely left out there. So there's something for you. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you out there.